Let's get started working on the skill, sales prices, find the original price. It is the end of watermelon season and watermelons are going on sale. Evan buys the biggest watermelon he can find for $2. What was the original price of the watermelon? And we have this coupon for 75% off. So the first thing that we need to think about is when we talk about percentages, that means really 75 out of 100. So if something is 75% off, what was the percentage that we actually paid for it? And we can do that by taking 100 and subtracting the percentage. So we really paid only 25% of the original price. And that's going to really help us to try to figure out what the original price was. So we know that we paid 25 out of 100 because we only paid part of it, which is why we're using a fraction because fractions represent the part over the whole. So the part that we paid was 25 and we want to know how much it was altogether. So we want to make an equivalent fraction to represent the actual cost. $2 was only part of the original, so it's going to go in the top with the part that we paid. And when we don't know something, we use a variable, so we're going to use an x for the original price, because that's what we're trying to find. Now, what we've done here is we've set up a proportion. These two fractions are equal to each other. 25 over 100 equals 2 over x, or 25% of what we paid over 100% of what we paid is equal to the $2 over the original price. Now, when we solve a proportion, we can cross multiply and then solve for x. So we're going to multiply. 25 times x to give us 25x equals 2 times 100, which is 200. Now we have 25 times x. To undo this multiplication, we're going to use division. We're going to divide both sides by 25. 25 divided by 25 is 1, so we're just left with x. We're just left with x. And 200 divided by 25 is equal to 8. That means that the original price of the watermelon was $8, and because it was 75% off, Evan only had to pay 2. Jackson buys a bunch of flowers on sale for $9. What was the original price of the flowers? And they were 10% off. They were 10% off how much percentage is left for what we actually paid. So that's 100 minus 10 means that we paid, or that Jackson paid, 90% of the original. So our first fraction is 90 over 100. The part that he paid was $9, and we are trying to find what the original price was. So you have 90 times x, which is 90x, time, or equal to 100 times 9, which is 900. Now we're going to divide both sides of our equation by 90. We get that x is equal to 10. So the original price of Jackson's flowers were $10. On Boxing Day, Avery buys an action figure on sale for $1. What did the action figure cost before the sale? The sale was 80% off. And 100 minus 80 is equal to 20. So Avery only spent... 20% of what it usually is. So we've got 20% over 100 
it's equal to how much he paid, the part that he paid, $1, over the original that we're, we don't know yet. 20 times x is equal to 100 times 1. Divide by 20. 100 divided by 20 is equal to 5. It means x is equal to 5. So the original price of the action figure was $5. On Boxing Day, Olivia buys an action figure on sale for $2. What did the action figure cost before the sale? 75% off was the sale. That means that 25 was the amount that we actually had to pay. 25 over 100 is equal to 2 over x. 25 times x is 25x, and 2 times 100 is 200. We're going to divide both sides by 25, and 200 divided by 25 is equal to 8. So that means that x is equal to Eight, the original amount or original price that Olivia spent on the action figure would have been eight dollars. A dinner has an early bird special. Any meal before 8 a.m. is on sale for one dollar. What was the original price of a meal? If it was 80% off, that means we only have to pay 20% of the original price. 20 over 100 is equal to 1 over x. 20 times x is equal to 100 times 1. And when we divide both sides by 20, we get that x is equal to 5. So the original meal price was $5. A furniture store is having a sale. If Savannah bought a sofa for the sale price of $3, what was the original price of the sofa? And it looks like the sofa was 50% off. That means it was half price. So the other half of 100 is also 50. So we have 50 over 100 is equal to 3 over something that we don't know yet. 50 times x is equal to 100 times 3. Then we're going to divide both sides by the number in front of x, which is 50. And 300 divided by 50 is 6. Now let's think about that one logically for a minute. If it was 50% off and we paid 3, then that meant the other half also had to be 3. And if we do 3 plus 3, we get 6. So that could have been another way to do it, but I wanted to stay consistent to show you that proportion. The original price of that sofa was $6. If a bike has a sale price of $6, what was the original? And it was 60% off. So that means that we're actually paying for 40% of the original. So we've got 40 over 100 is equal to 6 over x. 40 times x is equal to 6 times 100. And we're going to divide both sides by 40, and 600 divided by 40 is equal to $15. So that bike originally costs $15.
On Boxing Day, Darren buys an action figure on sale for $7. What was the action figure cost before the sale? The sale is 50%. That means we pay the other half. Now let's think about it. We had a 50% before. If 7 was the first half, the other half also had to have been 7. So that meant the total would be $14. A furniture store is having a sale. If Jackson bought a sofa for the sale price of $9, what was the original price? Now it was 25% off. So that means we have to pay 75% of the original price. 75 over 100 is equal to 9 over the original price. 75x is equal to 900. And we're going to divide both sides by 75. 900 divided by 75 is equal to 12. So the original price of the sofa is $12. On Boxing Day, Maya buys an action figure for $12. What was the action figure's cost before the sale? We paid 20%, or I'm sorry, if it was 20% off the sale, that means we paid 80%. 80 over 100 is equal to 12 over the original cost. 80x is equal to 1200. If we divide both sides by 80, we get 1200 divided by 80, which is 15. So the original price of that action figure was $15.